and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario RPG. Let's get back here. So let's make our way back here to talk to Toad about what happened at Bowser's Castle. I don't know why he's just staring out the wall there. He's not tall enough to really be looking out the window, but oh well. And apparently, even though Mario can't talk, he's pretty good at uh, charades and explaining what's going on. Nine Toads able to understand what's going on, so he's gonna run off. And boop! Oh, bonked us in the head. And that actually will take one P out. Now, if you say, I have no idea, it's going to give you a little tutorial. Let me just push X. So now, there's a little delay, but you can't do anything else, you have to select it, and you can't go back like he just showed you in, in the little tutorial, so you actually have to select it and use the mushroom. Let's see what happens if you select the other option. Of course I do. Don't have to go through the little tutorial. So Here's another little tutorial on timed hits. And pause. And he's going to tell us how to do it. Now even though he shows you to push the A right as the swing's coming forward, it actually works when you, the first punch connects. And as you say there, he said it doesn't always work though. And by that I think it means that it doesn't always reduce the attack to zero but it will reduce some of the damage so here's our special jump and you're gonna push it right when you're about to land on the enemy get three mushrooms and then let's see what happens if you say yes and the Goomba just runs off and we still get three mushrooms which, so it's better just to do that because you're not going to get any experience points from the time hits and I said I'll be explaining the timing each time so 
So we got a group of three Goombas, and as you can see, that little bump still left us with one HP gone. If you don't do the tutorial, you get an extra mushroom, though, so your choice. And you saw that little flower that said HP Max, those are random and there are different effects that they come with. I'm just going to go through these fights pretty quickly and I'm not going to edit them out at this point since they go by pretty fast. And here we got five coins. And just two Goombas this time. And here's a new enemy. These are the Sky Troopers. Got a pretty decent physical defense, but they are weak to jump. As you can see, they're 93. Versus 8. <laughs> so, two shots will take them out. And they dropped a mushroom and some coins. Taken care of. And might need to heal up after this fight. So, got a mushroom here and heal up. Let me show you the menu here real quick, and it will expand as new stuff happens. And this is what we start out with. Your status, speed, attack, defense, how much experience you need, and how much you currently have. A special shows you all your special attacks, and it shows you down in the bottom right corner there the timing for it, and the lower left when you gain your next special. And then we have equipped, we don't have anything to equip yet, but we will in the near future. And same as special items. There's eight coins there. And see Toad is trapped by some Goombas. Let's take them down. And we gain our first level. And as you can see, everything's going to level up here. And with each of these, if you just push A, you can see what bonus, how big of a bonus you'll get. Now for me, I take whatever's going to be the most beneficial. The HP is usually always three or four, or sometimes more. So if it's more than three or four, I'll take that. If the magic 
attack is three or more, I'll take that. If the regular attack is two or more, I go with that. But in this case, we're going to go with the magic. And so we get a honey syrup that recovers 10 FP, as you can see. And I'm going to stop here, and uh, I will go off screen, rest, and save. And I will see you next time. Have a good day.